So, Saha, you're going to talk to us today about the play you wrote, The Flood Thereafter, and your inspirations. Yep. So, I, uh, the inspiration of that play was a um, strip of art I saw around the, uh, on a road trip I did uh, to Gastasia near uh, Cap Mouraska. And it's a stripper club named Limotion in the middle of nowhere. And um, when I saw that, I, I, I thought it was very poetic in a way and pathetic in another way. A stripper club in the middle of nowhere. And I, I wonder who strips there and who are the clients of that bar. So I imagine a story around that question. So, um, and the, the, the presence of the river uh, in the lower St. Lawrence um, area is so strong that for me it was an evidence that it was going to be a mermaid story. Mm -hmm. So uh, I took inspiration on the mermaid story I knew, so uh, the little mermaid from Anderson and uh, Odysseus from uh, Omer. And I took also an inspiration of uh, the story of Samson and Delilah because uh, of the importance of the hair in the mermaid stories. Mm -hmm. So that were my inspirations. And I tried to, um, to create a play um, in the, at the same time very poetic and mythic, mythologic, and to create my own mythology um, with, with these um, elements very uh, st uh, strongly sim symbolic mm -hmm. and um, also something very rude, very um, realistic, um, harsh or something like that, like like a super club around the St. Lawrence River. 